For centuries, humans have fought their wars with swords, guns, and tanks. We are accustomed to waiting to fire until we see the whites of our enemy's eyes. a sword or a gun or a tank, one that does not even have whites of its eyes to wait to see. This enemy was discovered June 5th, 1981, when the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention reported a cluster of what was then classified as pneumocystis carini pneumonia in five homosexual men in Los Angeles. Originally dubbed GRID, or Gay-Related Immune Deficiency, health authorities soon realized that nearly half of the people identified with the syndrome were not homosexual men. In 1982, the CDC introduced the term AIDS to describe the newly recognized syndrome. Since recognized in 1981, it is estimated that AIDS has killed more than 25 million people. Most researchers believe that HIV originated in Sub-Saharan Africa during the 20th century. It is now a pandemic, with an estimated 38.6 million people now living with the disease worldwide. no cure for AIDS or HIV. There is no vaccination or pill or homeopathic remedy that will make us well again after we contract it. It's difficult to imagine something so powerful and something so small. guilt, remorse, or preference, AIDS is heartless. A predator wisely finding the crack in the human system.